You love the sounds of screaming children, right? No? Well, too bad! <gasps> well... And... Lots of... Fun. 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 Uh oh. Oh, it's getting faster. Oh. Um. Okay. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. Yay. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Point-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a... Okay! That was a long intro. But, uh, this is uh, the FNAF game that won the votes in my Discord. So, I guess we're doing this! This, we're doing this, I guess. Um, how to. A two-step guide to restaurant management. Use catalog mode to purchase items, animatronics, and other supplies. Okay. Aww. Use blueprint mode to place items, upgrade items, and upgrade your floor plan. Okay. I'm ready. Let's get started. <coughs> Day one. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your hundred. left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to- So, uh, what do we- we got a balloon barrel. Uh, the entertainment and bonus revenue is one. Oh, I don't like that. Um, discount ball pit. Okay, um, colorful, we could surely add some color, right? Well, we only have a hundred bucks, so we should probably, that's not the atmosphere, but they should save our money up. Okay, so, um, okay, let's buy it, forget it, okay, um, Stage? That doesn't do much. A double stage? Oh my god, I don't have enough. A sanitation station? Oh my god. Discount cooling unit? Oh, we need that. Yeah, health and safety, we need that. Okay. 
Entertainment, bonus revenue, yeah, oh! Oh, light animatronic, okay. Paper Pals, why not? Um... Sold out, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Okay, let's go into blueprint mode for now. Oh, WASD, well I'm missing an S key, so this is gonna be difficult. Uh, can I just, can I use arrow keys? No, okay. This is gonna be weird. Um, oh. Clean and polish? Oh, I don't have, wait, what's this? Fight. Fig, fig type pop soda. Have a poppin' good time with fug tube. Oh, fizz, fizz. Okay, fizz. Fizz Time Pop Incorporated is offering to pay for advertising in your establishment. Ooh, I'll take the money. I'll take the money. Okay. So, we can buy a stage now. Um, let's just do the one for now and see what kind of animatronic. We got Bucket Bob, Mr. Can Do, he's literally trash, Mr. Hugs, I don't think that's safe, Number One Crate, Pan Stand, <coughs> and a cough. Okay, so, um, I like Bucket, 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 Bucket Bob, so we're gonna get Bucket Bob. Stand? Dance budget tech. Oh, okay. Um, so we got some entertainment. Bonus revenue? I'm getting that. Um, neon stage lights. Okay, uh, happy frog. Mr. Hippo. Ned Bear. Pig Patch. Candy Cadet. Oh my god, okay. Um. I mean, we can buy this, but it's gonna use all my money. Um. <sighs> Alright. The health and safety is good, so. I'm fine, I guess. Okay! Nice. Faz rating. What is the Faz rating? We're finished for the day, I guess. Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome. That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, onto other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector. Okay, I've got a question. Why is the computer off? And how do I turn it back on? I moved my mouse over here to see what these were and I moved. That was creepy. So, 
I can't click any of these. Oh yeah, I clicked C, I clicked Z. Okay, that was weird. I clicked Z to see if I could have like a thing here, but I didn't, so, oh well. Order supplies, order cups. Okay, so let's see what the other rooms are. So, I guess. Nothing. Yeah, there's no motion. Oh, it stops if I go to another tab. Okay. So don't go to another tab. All right, I got it. Great job. It looks like <laughs> you're getting so the hang easy. of this. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Okay, well I got Miss Kitty with me right now. What do you want to say? Congratulations on completing your first day. However, your job isn't over just yet. What do you mean? There is another work? aspect to your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. What? Oh, Things God! Things are found here quite often. And while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Of course, as with everything else in this line of work, those benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside. But then, you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it- Throw it back into the alley. Proceed with salvage. I get $500 for the salvage? I'll you do it. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember, use your company as your taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. What? Document results. No. Begin oh, audio God. prompt in three, two, one. Did it move? Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Oh knock, knock. I'm here. You lost the salvage. And something is loose in your pizzeria? I got zero lawsuits. But I lost! How did I not die? How am I alive? Usually when you die, you have to retry it or just quit the whole game. Huh? Okay, whatever. Um. Well, I can buy a stage now. I can buy that. Can we buy a nice... Buy a frog. 
Buy a frog. Oh god. Let's buy Mr. Hippo. Okay. So I got no money. Yippee. Now go away. We got a newcomer. Yay. Here. I literally know, don't even need to turn off the fan. And I'm turning off the fan. What was that? I think I just, I, I think there's some brown bricks in my pants. You, you go up there. Okay, I hate this. This is scary. Okay. He's there. Let's bring him back. Throw to some plates. Turn off the fan. It's okay. I'm freezing my. I'm freezing. It's literally. It's literally winter. Okay, where is he? Where's he at? That, that voice! audio you love the audio you love the sounds of screaming children right no well too bad <gasps> See you guys later.